Let's say person number one is pushing on this box, exact same force as before, so we'll call it F1. But then we have another person on the other side of the box pushing, but pushing against you. So this is F sub two. If I have a box and I'm pushing this way, and then I have another box and I'm pushing this way, and because the lengths of the arrows are the same, what's gonna happen to the box? Well, you know from experience, if I'm pushing with the exact same force that I'm pulling, then, or I'm pushing against, then the box is gonna stay here and there'll be no, basically no arrow acting on it. So the resultant is basically equal to zero. Why? Because they canceled out. Because you see, it was still 10 Newtons here, if, if we're going with numbers, right? It could be whatever. This was 10 Newtons, let's just pretend this is 10 Newtons. And this is still 10 Newtons. But I'm proving to you by an example that you cannot just add vectors number to number. Because otherwise, this would be 10 plus 10 is 20. But you now know that, no, no, the direction does matter. Learn anything at mathandscience.com.